hello everyone what is up and welcome back to my channel so today's video i'm going to be telling you all about my favorite mature scents from bath and body works and mature i'm meaning like you're just gonna smell like a woman like you're really gonna smell like a grown woman and i love my sweet scents okay that's my all-time favorite scents is my sweet fruity scents I, those are just my favorite but a lot of the times I don't want to wear that and sometimes you don't want to smell fresh and clean you don't want to smell gourmand you don't want to smell fruity sometimes you just want to smell like a woman like just the easy like put it on and go and I find that these scents also last the longest for some reason fruity scents don't last as long on me as these do and I really really like them for that so let's just go ahead and get started because I have one two three four five six I have seven here okay <laughs> this is in the stars this has been my favorite for quite a while okay the this is starflower sandalwood musk sugared tangelo white agar wood and radiant amber i'm not really sure what agar wood is but i assume it's just kind of like a woody like cedarish scent scent um this scent is borderline manly and <clears throat> i don't personally think it smells like cologne but a lot of people do but it's just like to me it's just like a really womanly scent it just makes you smell like a woman um I really really like the packaging on this it's gold and it's just one of those like kind of new year's esque packagings um I also really really like mixing this with my sweet scents if you ever have tried Parasamore and you love it mix this with that and smell it oh you're gonna you're gonna fall in love with it it smells so good so the next one is Japanese cherry blossom now I know that a lot of you hate this I know a lot a lot a lot of people do not like JCB Jasmine Bullard and Natalie Grace here on YouTube both kind of got me on to this like Japanese cherry blossom train um and I walked in and I smelled it and I was like wait this really isn't bad so the notes for Japanese cherry blossom are Japanese cherry blossom Asian pear fresh mimosa petals white jasmine and blushing sandalwood this okay a lot of people think it smells like an old lady like a grandma type of scent not that I have anything wrong with grandmas, love my grandmas, but that's just what people say, is that it's like a really old lady kind of scent. And yes, I know what you're talking about, but I feel like any age people can pull this off. This is my sister's favorite scent, and she smells great all the time. She just, she loves this scent, and she wears it, and I find that it's really, really nice, really florally. So if you like florals, you'll probably fall in love with this. And if you haven't smelled this, girl, where have you been? Because this has been around since I was in diapers, probably before that, so... I would definitely recommend giving it a try if you haven't already and if you hate it just smell it again like go into the store and just give it a give it a smell and see if your nose has changed because mine did so my next favorite scent is sensual amber now I was not about this scent for kind of a long time I'm not really sure why but I just didn't really like it um, the scent notes are golden amber, wild berries, orange flower, lotus petals, and creamy sandalwood. Probably because of the floral notes in this. It is very florally. Um, but it's just one of those scents that make you smell really, really womanly. It smells like a flower. This one does have like a little bit of a manly scent to it. Not this. This straight up smells like amber. Oh my gosh. It smells so, so, so lovely. But there's not really much else to say about this one. It says, feel the warm glow of golden sunlight on bare skin with sensual amber. I don't know why, but this seems like a summer scent for me. I feel like this is going to be one of those, like, summer, summery, mature scents for me. I don't know. We'll find out in the summer. So, my next one that I'm going to share. As soon as I smelled this, it reminded me of my mom. This is Mad About You. And I don't know why, because I feel like this scent has been around for a really long time. Maybe it's something she used, or maybe it smells like something she used. But this is just very fruity floral modern mature it's black currant bright peony pink jasmine white patchouli and vanilla musk okay yeah it's mostly flowers so it's definitely a floral it just smells really good i don't know why it smells like my mom i mean i remember she used chanel number no. five when i was a kid and i don't remember what else she used but that's not that's not what this smells like 
I don't know why this smells like my mom, but it totally does. Like, I don't know if you guys have ever smelled scents like that where it just smells like somebody you love. Like, this is exactly what I'm talking about. And it's just a floral, really, really fruity, really, really florally, really, really womanly. It's just, it's, it's amazing. And it lasts a long time on your skin. Like, you will smell this later. Like, you will smell this way later in the day. It'll last, like, so many hours. It's amazing. So my next favorite is Into the Night. Now, I know that this is a lot of people's favorite scent. This is Raspberry Noir, Amber Crystals, Velvety Rose Petals, Creamy Patchouli, and Mocha Musk. This is a really mature scent, okay? If you're young and you want to wear this, go for it. But for me, this is, like, grown woman going out with her grown woman friends or her man on an anniversary type of night this is like a christmas scent like go smell like this on christmas this is a special occasion kind of scent okay because this is really womanly like if you want to smell like a woman buy into the night i also really really like this scent in the shower gel i don't know why but i find smelling it in the shower gel it just like fills up the entire bathroom with into the night and it's lovely and you can definitely smell that patchouli in there pretty pretty strong yeah it's just really really good i would definitely recommend going to smell this if you haven't already so i have two more scents um the one i want to talk about now doesn't have the cap because it was just it just came out of my purse i don't keep the caps on the ones that i keep in my purse i keep two in my purse at all times and i don't keep the caps on because i know that i'll lose them so this is a thousand wishes now you know that i love this scent if you follow my channel also it's almost gone i already have a backup ready for me um the notes i brought this for the notes this is pink prosecco sparkling quince crystal peonies gilded amber and amaretto cream i don't know what about this smells so mature to me <sighs> because it's fruity and it's florally and it's good and you can you kind of get that little bit of like bubbliness from the prosecco too it's really really nice um this is one of my mom's favorite as well one of my favorites it's amazing i would definitely recommend going to smell it um i don't really know what else to say about it i just use it all the time and you can tell because it's almost gone so if you want to smell what i smell like most of the time go get you some of this the very last one that i want to talk about today is you're the one now i know that this is a cult favorite and a lot of people hate this scent so it's like super super controversial some people think this smells like trash and some people smells think it smells really good don't ever put this on if you have a headache because it'll be way 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 too strong for you this is white birch velvety rose and a drop of strawberry nectar it is very florally it's just straight up rose scent with like the slightest sweetness from the strawberry if you want to smell like a rose buy this okay that's a very expensive smelling rose really nice smelling rose but smells like rose okay there's not really much else to say about it it's beautiful this is the one that probably lasts the longest this into the night and mad about you probably last the longest on me um especially this one this you will smell like eight days later like you don't want to shower for eight days girl <laughs> buy you some you're the one please shower that's nasty um, so yeah, that is all of the scents that I wanted to talk about with you guys today. That's all my mature scents. A lot of the times I want to smell like a woman. So those are the scents that I go to when I want to smell like that. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.